Searching beneath the surface in hopes of unearthing a key clue in an unsolved murder. The sister of Molly Bish and a private investigator believe that a car possibly linked to Bish's kidnapping and murder may be buried in a former campground in West Brookfield. And that's where we find WBZ's Jim Smith live with these new developments tonight. Jim? David, this search took all day long at a location only about four miles from the pond in Warren where Molly Bish first vanished. And today's Molly's mother made a dramatic visit to the search scene. Make my heart good to see all you people. Come. Maggie Bish has been searching for nearly 17 years, looking for the person who murdered her daughter Molly. Now that search leads to the woods of West Brookfield, an old campground where experts are looking for any traces of a car that might be buried here. A car possibly driven by a suspect Maggie herself saw the day before Molly vanished. You know, all I really, really want is justice for Molly. Oh my God, we need peace as a family. It's been a long, long journey and I'm tired. And my poor husband, you know, we've had a tough physical year and a device that sends the signals down into the ground. These are going to mark if there's any anomalies. A criminologist is volunteering his time and his equipment probing the area with ground penetrating radar that looks down 15 feet. And what we're looking for is any kind of anomaly. The ground has been disturbed. We can look at the different strata. So if you can dig a hole, take the sand out, put the soil back in, compact it, it's different than the soil around it. All this area was part of it. A private investigator says tips about a suspect led them here. He was reported to be at this campground driving a very badly damaged white vehicle. Uh, he was reported to have scratches on his face um, and a broken nose and other injuries. They have now wrapped up for the day, and the private investigators tell us that they have found several compelling areas of interest. We'll have more about that coming up at 6 o'clock. Live in West Brookfield, Jim Smith, WBZ News.